What would you advise your kid that no one advised you? Mistakes are something to learn from, not to be afraid of. The importance of accepting failure and learning from it. If they complain about school and say when am I ever going to need to know this, just straight up say that no you want, but that's not the point of education. If education was supposed to be about learning things that you will use, that you would learn to cook, do laundry, write emails, networking, personal finance, and so on. But it's not that. The point of education is to teach you a little bit about a lot of things. And it's not so much about what you learn, but about how you learn. So no, you're never going to use calculus, and you're never going to need to know the major themes of Shakespearean plays. But you will use critical thinking, reading comprehension, study habits, organizational habits, and so on. Don't take criticism from someone you wouldn't go to for advice. Don't date someone or use someone as a rebound just because you're lonely or need someone. It's always worth waiting for the right person even if it's painful to wait. A few, one always leave the party before the devil shows up. Two when shit's wild, do nothing. Say nothing. Chill three wear a condom sport four look people in the eyes when you listen. Four when you speak five speak clearly. Six it's okay to say sorry even if you know you aren't wrong. Holy shit this list could go on, but then again I had no one advising me on shit ever. You need to brush your teeth and floss and brush your tongue too. And wear sunscreen year round if you're pale. Ignore anyone who tells you something along the lines of it's okay if you are x years old and don't have your life figured out yet. While it isn't inherently false, it can lead to the mindset where you put off trying to figure stuff out. Then before you know it, you are approaching your 30s and you haven't made any tangible progress towards any of the goals you wanted to accomplish. It doesn't matter if you are a teenager or if you are in your 20s, you should always try to work towards some sort of long-term goal. Otherwise you will become complacent and your life will just stagnate. Save at least 50 from every paycheck. More if you can. Don't buy useless stuff. Stranger danger is generally BS. You're far more likely to be assaulted by someone you know. Not all of your friends are really your friends. Don't go to Reddit for advice. Here, have this can of mace, go spray it in the face of your bullies.3. Talk to people and be active in high school. It took me years after graduating to actually learn how to properly socialize with people. Trust your gut feeling. Girl get some type of training degree after high school before you get married and have kids. Nothing wrong with wanting a trad wife life. But you need to able to support yourself if it doesn't work out treat all men like a loaded gun. Not all men are dangerous, but you can't let your guard down ever. You can always come home. Please come home. You never have to be embarrassed or ashamed. You are wanted and welcomed here always. We can figure anything out together. You are never stuck in any situation. If someone especially a family member makes you uncomfortable let me know. You are amazing and you can always come to me. You can always get help. You have a lot of champions. After my dad died, it felt like nobody in my life gave a shit about me for about 8 years. It's okay to be weird. If you are going to go to college, consider if the degree will enable you to earn good money in the future not just that you conceptually enjoy the subject. And ID give encourage them give them a financial investing, budgeting education. Love many, trust few, always paddle your own canoe.